So today's video is going to be the first startup of the Xbox One X. We got Cray here. He's out of the frame, but he's here. He can. He's going to do the honors. Go ahead, Cray. Now, I want to make sure you got this hooked up to the 4K. If you want 4K output, you need 4K TV too. Make sure your HDMI is 4K. So I'm sure we're going to have to. That's pretty nice. I'm sure we're going to have to go through a setup. On Probably. Mm-hmm. Now, you can tell down below compared to the PS5, it's a lot smaller console. Oh, set up with the Xbox app. Okay, we can skip that. Oh, and then go up one so you in Spanish. I think. No. Different languages. What, well, Xbox spelled the same way in Japanese or China one? Okay, skip. English. United States. Network is contacted. Yes, we are. Where do you live? United States. It's time to update. The size of it is 81 megabytes. Yep. So now we wait for update. Shouldn't take long with my internet. It's pretty fast. I ain't much on disk drives, but if you want to buy a used game that you might not want to pay full price for, disk drive's nice to have when you can go buy, you know, get it used off somebody. Yeah. And if you enjoy it, you can buy always buy it digital later. We sell that copy and then. Yeah. I'd rather have the digital content because of this can get damaged. You can, yeah. Flight PS5 is running almost six terabytes right now. It's got a lot, but mostly PS4 games. <coughs> Set tight while we update your Xbox. I guess you're right, but apply an update. I don't know what the internet port right now is on that. Or does it automatically connect to your internet? It's hardwired in. I got a hardwire all the way to this now. Same as my other power cables is behind the wall. My HDMI cables and stuff. Hidden. That's how come I, I forgot about that plug in. Which I'll be redoing a lot of my cable management soon. Because yeah. I use this area a lot. It's getting messy again. I had it cleaned up. You can see on it all where my computer is. It's a, it's scary. Yeah, it's very scary. Which I will be putting my computer in a new case soon. Yeah. So when I do that, I build a nice little shelf for it and stuff. And then I build me a new PC going wall or something. It's time to update. <laughs> Squeaky toy. <toe. laughs> Hmm. I guess time to update controller. Keep it motionless and turned on. That's cool. You know the PlayStation 5 updates the controller too, but you have to plug it in. Mm-hmm. The PS5 also come with a charge cable to plug it in with. I didn't, the X didn't come with nothing like that, did it? Just batteries. Mm -hmm. Which I will get another X controller, but I got that one controller right now. But if I get rid of the Xbox One, I won't have that controller no more. I got to send her something with the console. Yeah. 
I will keep the uh, Xbox One's Connect though because it's workable over here and when I stream, you know, it's a good streaming camera. Yeah. It's pretty good quality. Now, the PlayStation 5 camera is badass, guys. I got to give it credit. It's a great upgrade if you got a PS5. Yeah, that webcam is very good. Yeah. yeah, it don't have the functions of, like, to use VR or nothing with it, but... It's pretty good. Now, I got two PlayStation 5 cameras. I don't know if we want to work with the X or not, but, you know, this is something we could always try. <laughs> Next. Now, guys, you don't get to see this part. It looks good to me. Uh, you are done something up. Time to play. Take me home. That's cool. Now I have no games or anything on this guys. I can't show you any gameplay or nothing. But it's pretty painless to pretty well sign into your Xbox. You know? Mm -hmm. Pretty good. We have all this. Xbox Live Gold. So guys, that's pretty well hit. That's the Xbox X fully turned on for the first time before we set up. It's pretty painless. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you enjoyed it, be sure to drop a like, leave a comment, show your support by smashing that subscribe button. Thank you for watching.